What's up guys? I'm here with a message. No, no, not my show. That happens on my show. This is very much me coming in here on the Sentai Review wanting to say something, which is actually the Fandom Night channel, and I've argued for a while as to whether or not we should change it back to the Fandom Night channel. That way we can actually start getting all the old shows back on here as well and kind of focus on that. All subjects that we could talk about at a different time. Guys, there will be no episode this week. I know... I'm sorry, I'm legitimately sorry. We even set up a second studio for issues like this where where something would have come up and I would have been gone and but turns out it there was destin destiny uh pretty much had it in place that there was going to be no episode. Um Shane will not be not via, not be available this week. He's actually looking at houses. He finally got approved and his stuff is going over well and he's looking at moving into a house, getting out of the apartment, looking for a more stable permanent location and so on and so forth. So absolutely no absolutely no Shane. Uh Seth is stuck at work. Yeah. Um even after He's starting to get his new position where he will actually be writing the schedule and stuff like that. It, it doesn't change the fact that if people don't come to work, he has to fill in those positions. So Seth will be at work. So we won't, we wouldn't have Seth. Uh, like I said, Shane, he's got the houses thing. There's, sorry, Seth may, however, be available in a different form if you go over to his channel on Sario Says. Uh, he always does like, he always does like streams and whatnot where he does a stream and he just hangs out and anybody that wants to ask him questions or talk to him about whatever, you can always do so. So you can bring your ranger questions over there or whatever else you may happen to have. Um, Nick also will not be available for this week. Nick has, Nick is forced, so he will be working. He works third shift, so he more than likely still would have made it over here. But at the same time, he has a wedding on the day of filming, so one way or another, he wasn't making it. Nick does not have a presence online, YouTube, or anything like that, so you can't really go over there and check him out. I'm sorry. Uh, I am going to be out of state. I'm still dealing with a lot of stuff that stems from my family family coming back together. It's really complicated. I've talked about it once or twice in a podcast and here and there, but because that's happening, I have to make a trip out of state to go, to go see some people. And so that takes me out. However, um, if you're still looking for some kind of content that deals with me, you can always go over to my channel. I post almost an episode a day. I've been posting like crazy lately. Um, so that's fandom with Reploid Bill, and you could always go over there and check that out, and there's bound to be shit going on over there. Uh, Scott is the only one, as far as I have gathered, that would have been available. But, Scott is not a one-man show. Kind of. He does have his own YouTube. If you if you want to see what Scott is up to this week, there is a different way to get a hold to not get a hold of him necessarily, but to see him. He has a show called Action Talk, uh, and you can look for that. He used to be uh, Action Video Game Talk, I believe. Now he just calls his show Action Talk. I believe his YouTube is under the name Action Talk. That's not Action Talk TV. That's a different thing altogether. Um, his name, YouTube has a bit of a naming issue, so uh, yes, if you try to look him up, I will try to post his link in the in the stuff below so you can just find his direct link, because if you try to look him up, sometimes you will find the other five action talks that exist, and he's not them. So, sorry guys, uh, we will not be able to look at costumes or zords because it was also brought to my attention that we missed one of the one of the robots in general and some stuff like that 
I'm sorry. Uh, every now and then this happens with the show being live and with it going on at the same time every time. I knew that this was going to happen from time to time, which is another argument to bringing back the channel as Fandom Night, to switch it back to Fandom Night. Because in a case like this, we could have met up Friday night and we could have recorded an episode and had it posted. But the Sentai Review is a live show. It's not the video game show. It's not the comic book show. It's not the podcast show. It's not the what up. It's, it's just not. It's a very different animal, and because it is a different animal, we like to be live with the Sentai Review. There are a couple episodes that we may have to go back to filming for. We've had, uh, we've been discussing the uh, series reviews, and to do the series reviews, we're thinking about going back to the actual original recording format, where we record that episode, then we mention that it's going to be going up, and so on and so forth. A lot to talk about, always a lot to talk about. The show is always growing, always changing, always adapting, always adjusting to different ideas that we come up with and things like that, and that's just the way it is. So, guys, Reploid Bill, I apologize. That's the way it is. We will not have an episode this week, but like I said, there are other YouTubes, other ways to check us out if you are absolutely desperate to keep your content moving. So... I mean, I'm not Shane. My exit is a little different on my show. I don't go, bye. I, uh, I say, I'm going to get out of here. Scott says many different things. Seth says things along the lines of, I'm tired. Either way. No episode this week. Sorry. <laughs>